Hello, today we're going to be discussing how to tie a fish bag. Generally when I'm working and I'm brought fish, whether it be from customers because I don't want them or because they've had too many babies, this is what I'm presented with. No air, a saggy bag, feels like a breast implant gone wrong. That's not how you want to be doing your fish bags and I will show you exactly how you should be doing it. What you're looking for is about two thirds air, one third water. So what are you going to need? An empty fish bag like this. Doesn't matter if it's used or new, as long as it hasn't got any holes in. Some have these edges which prevent the corners and trapping the fish. So if you can get these kind, they're good. Also, an elastic band is helpful for turning the top so, first thing you want to do is roll up the sides and you will have something that looks like that. It doesn't really have to be neat, it just has to be functional. A benefit of this as well is when you're putting it into your aquarium. Um, this is my aquarium in this instance. What it does help is it traps air so your bag will float. And that way you can have your bag in your aquarium when you're catching your fish. So, put some aquarium water in there, good, and then put your fish in, and you should have something that looks vaguely like that, and then we'll roll the sides up again, and then I'll show you how to continue. So you should end up with something like that. can stand up on its own, generally don't leave the room though, but it tends to be fine. What you need to do now is put your hand in and just spread the bag open just so you can get as much air in there as, as possible, which is important because that's what gives the fish the oxygen when you're travelling with them. Now, you don't have to be fast with this, I see a lot of videos, um, especially American ones where they have to go as quickly as possible not necessary, I think that's what makes it harder for people. All you need to do is just tease the top together, open your fingers like that, just tease it together, and then you'll end up with a little tuft. Grab that with your other hand and just begin to twist it, and that will trap the air in the bag. To be quite tough with it, and there you go, you'll end up with something like that. The bag will be pretty hard. And then all you do is you fold that bit over there, so it's doubled over on itself. Get your elastic band, and then put that round a couple of times. And there we have it. Perfect. So we've got about a third, maybe a quarter of water. The rest is air. Your fish will be happy. You can travel with them, probably in a bag like that, you might get an hour to two hours, so long as the temperature stays uh, correct. Happy days. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you like it, and I'll see you again.